Okay, so the one minute time frame is beneficial to use in certain situations. One of those being within the first 15 minutes of the market open. If you look at AKTX here, it made a pretty big push today, reaching $11.95, where it opened up just under uh, that 650 area. Okay, and this thing made a massive push, but what I really want to focus on, guys, is this first red candle right here. I love getting in using the one minute time frame right after that first one minute red candle. Okay, any stock after it makes a big push, it's going to need to consolidate it first and all these people that are watching this thing right here they're waiting for it to make a pullback okay and that's why this thing shoots up after this first red candle is because everybody's waiting to find an entrance okay and the reason the one minute time frame is beneficial is because if you look at the five minute you can't see any of that consolidation, any of those big dips. They're not as clear and it's harder to tell where to enter into a stock that's pushing up like AKTX did. And so that's why it's best in my mind to use the one minute time frame within the first 15 minutes. And so you don't miss any opportunities and you can kind of see where it's dipping down and consolidating. Okay, so another awesome strategy I like to use with the one minute time frame is the washout long setup. You can look here at DMPI yesterday. This thing gapped up in a big way overnight. And what happens with the washout long setup, the basic logic behind it is that people that held this stock long overnight, they're going to want to take profits and cover in the morning. And so you see these two red candles here. That's from people taking profits from holding it overnight. But once that stock breaks over that open high at about $1.90 right where it opened, it makes this big massive push up okay this is one of my favorite setups I know I've gone over it in a previous video but it's definitely an effective reliable strategy in my opinion and the reason the one minute time frame is beneficial using the strategy is because again just like the last section if you look at the five minute time frame you can't even see any of that consolidation you can't see that it was a washout long setup and even still this you know this big push doesn't even look that impressive on the five minute where it actually was a really big move going up from about the dollar 85 area all the way to 229 so that's a pretty big move guys okay and you'll miss it if you're trying to use the five minute chart within the first 15 minutes and so just make sure you focus on using the correct time frame for you during a set period of time and if you can you know you'll definitely see an improvement in your trading anyways guys that's the end of this video I just want to take a quick second to say thank you for all the love and support we've gotten if you want to do your most to help support this channel make sure you hit that subscribe button and give our videos a like it really does a lot to help support our channel and also make sure to come check out our free day trading chat room guys I post a link in each video's description so come check it out if you have time and good luck in the markets tomorrow thanks for watching